Calling all men of Upper Room, join us tonight for the third Sunday night service to be held at 6 p.m. The speakers will be Minister D'Amico Morell, Elder Carl Owens, and Elder Loring Roberts. Bishop Wooden will address the men of Upper Room Tuesday, August 23rd at 7.30 p.m. for our Tuesday night men's meeting. The meeting will be held in the Fellowship Hall. Join us for Tuesday night service, August 23rd at 7.30 p.m. in the Multipurpose Room. The speaker will be Evangelist Vicki Adams. The Ladies of the King's Court will host a back-to-school empowerment and all-girls prayer event Wednesday, August 24th at 7 p.m. This will be a time of empowerment for young ladies 13 and older and will include discussions on transitioning to high school, developing academic success, social pressures, and more. There will be food, fun, prayer, and a limited number of school supplies will be given away. For more information, contact Evangelist Tamika Douglas, an LKC staff member, or visit the Youth Ministry Office. The final stop for the Live, Grow, Share Tour will be Generation X. All ladies ages 35 to 50 should plan to join First Lady Pamela Wooden Wednesday, August 24th from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. in Classroom Number 1 for Talk It Out 2. Everyone is invited to this year's annual intercessory prayer breakfast, taking back God's promises through prayer, to be held here at Upper Room Church, Saturday, August 27th at 9.15 a.m. There will be a special musical guest, and the speaker will be Elder Robert L. Williams. Cooks are needed to work with the college ministry. If you are interested in serving in this capacity, please see Evangelist Marilyn Wagner. The kitchen will be open for college students next Sunday, August 28th, immediately following service. Generation Now invites all youth and parents to Firm Foundation every Wednesday from 6.30 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. in the Fellowship Hall. There is worship to live music, relevant messages, and practical training on how to become fishers of men. Also, on September 9th at 7.30 p.m., Generation Now will host a service entitled Satan Can Have Me with Youth Pastor John Amanchuku here at Upper Room, followed by a gospel skate party. Greetings, my name is Sister Beverly Hall and I'm the charter member of the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. To my beloved pastor, Bishop Wooden, happy 29th anniversary, sir. Your ministry has greatly affected my life more than you ever know. You have taught me to love God with all my heart, mind, and soul, to keep God first, to study the scriptures, to develop an effective prayer life, to live a life of excellence, to stand up and speak out on those issues that, that directly conflict and challenge the faith. My girls have grown up in this ministry, and because of your teaching, sir, they all love God, are saved, and in the church. Thank you for being there for us. Thank you for your labor. Know that it's not in vain. And thank you for being the greatest pastor in the whole world. To, to my Upper Room family and friends, Luke 10 and 7 says that the laborer is worthy of his heart. There's not much in anything that we can do or say for Bishop Wooden. He's an attentive shepherd, always caring about us, always praying about us, and always, always feeding us with a great word of God. I am looking forward to, and I encourage you, to come out and be a blessing to this worthy man of God on September the 18th. I look forward to seeing you there. God bless. I know my God can do it. Search me, search me. Everything will be Join us as we celebrate the pastoral anniversary of Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. Sunday, September 18th at 11 a.m. Pick up an information card after service in the vestibule. 